Given that vector a is 3 minus 2 minus 1 and vector b is vector 4, 2 minus 5 and c is 7 minus 14k, find p, q and k such that p times vector a plus q times vector b is equal to vector c. Right, so we have uh, p, 3, minus 2, minus 1 plus q, 4, 2, minus 5 is equal to 7 minus 14k. So we can write down equations from this. We can say that 3p plus 4q is equal to 7 and then that minus 2p minus, plus 2q is equal to minus 14. And that will set up some simultaneous equations which we can then solve um, using algebra. So we've got 3p plus 4q is equal to 7 from the top, from the x component, and then from the y component we've got minus 2p plus 2q is equal to minus 14. We just solve those simultaneously. So what I'm going to do is make this uh, 2 a 4 by multiplying the bottom one, which we'll call equation 2, by 2. Make sure you multiply everything, including the minus 14 at the end. And then all I need to do is subtract. So 3 minus minus 4 is 7p. 4q minus 4q gives me nothing. 7 minus minus 28 gives me 35. And that's going to give me that p is equal to 5. We just substitute back into 1 or 2. So substitute into 1. We're going to get that 3 times 5 plus 4q is equal to 7. 15 plus 4q is equal to 7. 4q will be equal to 7 minus 15, which is minus 8. And then we can see that q is equal to minus 2. Right, and in order to find k, we're just going to take this one here from the bottom row here, because we know that minus p plus minus 5q is equal to k. So 5, because uh, p is 5, p, 5 times minus 1 minus 2 times minus 5, minus 2 times minus 5 is equal to k. We just work that out, so it's going to give me minus 5 plus 10 is equal to k. k will be equal to 5. Okay, so there's been a video to show you how to work out some coefficients of a vector equation. I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.